You know the crispy edges on fried food? They're the best part, right? That's what these crullers are giving. If you're looking for a crispy snack, this recipe is for you. This is Family Meal, where we make memory-making meals with a splash of wine. Start by dumping all of the ingredients into a bowl. This fried crullo recipe gets its rise from the water, which creates steam when it hits the hot oil. It also has acid and soda, which makes the bread fluff up from CO2 bubbles. No yeast here. We're using simple technology to make delicious bread. Start mixing that into a nice dough. You can get it started in a bowl. Add the water in batches until you like the wetness. You may not need all of it. See how that's forming into a dough? Pour lemon juice over the dough and work it in. Try to soak up as much of the lemon juice as you can into the dough. Now flatten the dough into about a half an inch thick patty. Cut into quarter inch to half inch strands. And place these into the hot oil. Fry them in batches until golden. I was doing two at a time because of the size of my pot. Drain them on paper towel to get rid of the excess oil. These crullers are best right out of the fryer. Mine are crispy on the outside and cakey on the inside. They're a really craveable snack. Check out the link to the recipe in the description for some dip ideas. Or we have some homemade herb salts to add a flavorful kick to these crispy donuts. They're super simple to make. Just grind up some salt. And add your herbs. Then mix. I made fennel, juniper, and marjoram for the wine party. Click here to see the complete recipe with ratios. This recipe was inspired by Melinda Russell, the first black cookbook author in the United States. Click here to read her story.